Hey there, this is George the Tech. Just want to say thanks for choosing to work with us and I wanted to show you a couple tips about using Zoom. And uh, I want to have you Zoom working correctly and configured correctly before our session to get the maximum productivity we can. In Zoom, you'll notice that in the upper left hand corner is a button that says turn on original sound or some variation of that. It may say something about original sound on or off as well. That is a special feature that allows you to send high quality audio over Zoom. The quality is very similar to what you'd hear in Source Connect Now or IPDTL. And uh, it's highly usable for communication. Some might say you could even record from it, but I don't say that that's probably not going to be the case all the time. But whatever the case, it's really handy during a support session with me because I'll be able to hear your studio through Zoom in full quality not in zoom quality, which really crushes the dynamic range, uses a lot of noise reduction, and just kind of really makes it sound low fidelity. So here's how to make sure it's set up correctly. Make sure you go into your zoom preferences. And in the audio settings area, scrolling down until you find the music and professional audio section. Check the show in meeting option to turn on original sound checkbox, which is not on by default and then check high fidelity music mode. Now you don't need echo cancellation nor stereo audio, and therefore you also must use headphones for this to work without causing problems. Um, just make sure you've chosen to turn on original sound. So when it says turn off original sound, it's on. <laughs> when it says turn on original sound, it's off. Now newer versions of Zoom, I think have changed the language. But as long as you have that up and running, I will hear your sound quality the way it was intended in high quality, high resolution audio. Thanks for listening. This has been George the Tech. I look forward to working with you. <laughs>